Honorable Minister, Senior Officers of Government of India and Government of Orissa, Representatives of UN agencies, scientists, startups, distinguished guests, Mission Shakti, Ma Mane, Priya Chasi, Bhai Oboni Mane, Samastanku Namaskar. I welcome all of you to the International Convention on Millets. Millets are traditional grains, climate resilient, and a powerhouse of nutrition. Millets can play an important role to achieve nutritional security. Humble millets are emerging as a hope for our future. The United Nations has declared 2023 as International Year of Millets. Odisha is the first state to organize such an international convention in involving all stakeholders. Odisha is a pioneer in designing a people-centric millet mission with focus on livelihood and nutrition of our tribal communities. My government always prioritized the welfare of every segment of society. We launched Odisha Millet's mission in 2017 with a focus to revive the millets, force the promotion of millets is about justice and equity to rain-fed farmers of Odisha. To encourage millet cultivation, we have increased the direct benefit incentives for millets and laid out a short procurement of millets and of ragi. My government is investing over rupees 2,500 crores for providing income and livelihood support to farmers. I encourage all of you to spread the word about the millet's mission so every eligible farmer can, can become a part of this journey. It is also very heartening to see the journey of Mission Shakti, women's self-help group, in the millet value chain. Under the brand of Millet Shakti, Mission Shakti groups have shown the world how millet-based enterprises can play an important role in appealing to taste buds of consumers and improve livelihood. As the International Year of the Millet 2023 is coming to an end. The Convention on Millets provides an opportune moment to revisit the efforts and strategies of different stakeholders. My government with Bill Ortpult will put all his efforts to make Odisha become a center for excellence and contribute to economic growth well-being, and health of the people of Orissa. Bande Utkal Jananim.